Hi, this is David with David's Tutorials. And today, I'm going to show you how to fix a door that opens or closes by itself. Now, you may talk to carpenters or handyman or people who fix these sort of things, and what they'll tell you is you need to take out the frame of the door and get the levels and adjust it and put in shims. You don't have to do any of that. I'm here to tell you we can fix it so that this door doesn't open all by itself, and all you need is a hammer and a screwdriver and a nice piece of wood. I'll show you how we do that. We need to take the pin out of this hinge right here. It's pretty easy to do. Take your screwdriver and your hammer, get under the hinge, and lift it up. Here we go. That's it. Here we have the hinge pin. Let's go outside with the hinge pin and the hammer and our piece of wood. Here I am in my carport. I'm coming here because we have a nice hard concrete floor and in the house I don't want to take a chance on denting any floors or breaking any tiles. Concrete I'm not worried about. What we have here is the hinge pin. We have our piece of wood, we have our concrete, and we have our hammer. All I'm going to do now is hit the pin just a few times, just enough to get it bent. Oh, can you see that bend in there? That is a nice degree of bend. All we have to do now is take it back inside and put it back in the door and the automatic swing should be fixed. Okay, here we are back in the room with the door that has automatically swung itself open again. We're going to fix that. All we have to do is put in this new bent hinge pin. The pin's in. Let's see what happens when I let the door partially open. See if it stays where I put it or if it automatically swings itself farther open. Here we go. See that? The door is not moving. That's all you need to do. Take out one hinge pin, take it outside, put it on an angle somewhere, hit the pin with a hammer to bend it just slightly, only one about five degrees of bend, put it back in, that should solve your problem. If it doesn't solve your problem, guess what? You've got two more hinge pins. Try it with the second one. If that doesn't work, do it with the third hinge pin. If you bend three hinge pins and it still wants to swing on its own, then it's time to call a carpenter. Okay? Hope this helps you. And by the way, if you like this video, give us a good old thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and click that bell icon to be notified when we post another great tutorial from David's Tutorials. Take care.